Hello everyone, welcome to Vlogmas. I can't believe I finally get to say that. I am so, so excited to do this video series for the first time ever on my channel and to bring you guys along for a video every single day of the holiday season leading up to Christmas. So I am in a very festive mood and I'm really excited to kick off this whole series with making an advent calendar because that is one of my favorite parts of Christmas. I think it is so nostalgic because we've all probably had those little chocolate advent calendars when you were a kid and it's super exciting to go and open up the number on every single day and get a little treat or something so I thought I would do mine with you guys so I can show you how I've laid it out and which kind of calendar I've used and what I'm putting in it and the little bit of the theme as well so let's get straight into it and we can do this little DIY together but just a super quick reminder if you are new here don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button there is a new video coming your way every day for Christmas. So we're gonna have a lot of fun together. I've got a ton of DIYs, decorating things, baking, all sorts of stuff on the way. So cannot wait to share this with you guys. Now I'm gonna show you what I got because this is actually from a previous Kmart haul if you guys were watching. So. I will link it down below in case they're still in stock, which they hopefully might be if you want to jump on this a little bit later. But this is the advent calendar that I got. It is just a series of really cute little wooden houses and it was only $14. So this is what I'm going to use to hopefully pop these out and fill them with a couple of little treats and things. So the theme that I kind of wanted to do for this advent calendar is I'm going to call it like naughty or nice. And I feel like that is such a fun Christmas theme because I know my parents definitely used to threaten me that we would get like coal in our stockings for being bad children so yeah I am gonna do a naughty and nice challenge myself in this so I've got a couple of things to fill it up with so I will show you everything that I've got so I first of all just popped to the supermarket yesterday and I grabbed some chocolates because these are the naughty part of it so I've got these ones which are just dark chocolate lint balls because I absolutely love lint chocolate and I think the texture of it is super nice but I did go for dark chocolate because I don't want to be too naughty considering I'm going to be having one almost every single day and I also got these ones which are caramel squares but I'm kind of hoping these will fit into the houses because they're a little bit small so fingers crossed these aren't too big and they actually do fit inside of these little things but I've got those for my naughty treats and then for my nice things I've got a blend of two so I have a couple of little gifts that I'm gonna pop in to surprise myself along the way and I just think that's a, such a nice way to break up an advent calendar because I know a lot of um, cosmetic brands and things do them now like Esme Minerals or you know La Octane and things like that and they they will do like a, a skincare advent calendar or something really fun so I thought that I would pop in some jewelry in mine because because that is things that I can then grab out and wear in the holiday season as well. So I am going to show you guys those. And the final thing that I'll do, which will be my nice section of the calendar is I'm going to pop in a couple of fitness challenges. So if you have been following my channel for a while, you would know that I'm a huge fan of living a really healthy lifestyle. So I am going to put in a couple of things in here that are stuff that when I pull out that number, I have to do. And that could be anything from a 10 minute stretching session to a plank challenge or a couple of Pilates things or some push-ups or something but I just thought it would be a little bit of fun to kind of blend a healthy thing with my naughty treats so that just kind of leads to the whole balanced lifestyle which is definitely what I prefer to live I don't restrict myself in my eating in any way and I just think it is a really great idea over the holiday season to get that little burst of motivation if I wake up in the morning and I'm not getting a chocolate that day so that is that and I will show you my little box of goodies which is the jewelry that is going to be going in the calendar as well so for the jewelry I just wanted to thank Ana Luisa for sponsoring this part of the video I have worked with Ana Luisa before and you guys would know that I absolutely love their jewelry and I really do love beautiful fine jewelry and that is something they really specialize in but they also have an incredibly sustainable approach so even this box that it just came in is all recycled cardboard which is amazing for the environment environment because they are shipping them all over the world so it's really just reducing their footprint and I think that is really really impressive so 
their jewelry is really great for stacking so I do have this beautiful fine necklace on which is an Ana Luisa piece and I've also got a couple of other ones here as well so often I will wear two sets of earrings from them stacked next to each other or two necklaces at varying lengths and things and I really love that kind of layering with jewelry as well so they do do things in limited small batches which is really nice because it means you won't see a ton of people wearing your pieces because they're kind of just done in little cycles for the season so it's incredibly high quality and I just think these are some of the longest lasting jewelry that I've had in my collection and I just think their designs are so beautiful and really, really delicate. So I'll show you a couple of the pieces that I've got to pop into my little calendar. So this one are these beautiful little daisy earrings. And I thought these were so beautiful and dainty and just really, really lovely for that summer kind of feeling. And of course, to go with that, I had to get the matching necklace. So this is the matching necklace which has these beautiful little bauble details on it and I just thought this was so so cute so I absolutely cannot wait to pull those out of the calendar because I just think they are gorgeous and of course I wanted to get another pair of really simple classic earrings because that is definitely my style so I do have a similar pair like this from Ana Luisa before and I just wear them all the time because even when I'm going to the gym, they're just very fuss free and small. So I've got these beautiful little hoops and the stone in them is citrine, which is kind of like, it's almost like my birthstone color, like a light green sort of looking color. So these are absolutely beautiful and I also cannot wait to wear those. So if you are looking at grabbing some jewelry to treat yourself, or you also want to pop in some little gifts for yourself in an advent calendar or grab some gifts for other people, then I would definitely recommend shopping Ana Luisa. I do have a discount code with them as well. So I'm going to leave all the details down in the description box below and you guys can head on over to their website and grab a beautiful piece of jewelry and they do ship all over the world. So it doesn't matter where you are, you will be able to get your hands on some of their beautiful products. My gorgeous little boy Momo is sitting up on the bed here. So I thought he would see what we think about this calendar. Hey baby. Let's make this little advent calendar together for Christmas. What do you think? <laughs> what a good life cats have. They literally just sleep all day. So I've got to open this up because I haven't actually had a chance to go into all of these yet. So let's just grab a knife and I can get into that. So this is what the little houses look like when you pull them off, which is really great because they just have some little prongs here. So they just kind of slot back into the calendar and that's how you easily pull them out. So I am going to just test if some of these chocolates and things fit in there and then we'll see how we go. These ones fit in there quite nicely, but this is going to be way too big, which is really annoying because I did think these would be small enough to fit in there. So those are a little bit of a fail, but I'll have to just see how many of these chocolates I've got and then how many other little squares that I can put in there. Fourteen is my birthday number, so I'm going to put this necklace inside of there because that's going to be a little gift for me.
Now, of course, for the final Christmas day, I'm gonna put in the last chocolate I have because who doesn't wanna wake up and have chocolate on Christmas day? So that is it, we are all done. This is my fully stocked advent calendar and now I need to go and find somewhere to put it. So I have decided here in this little corner of the kitchen is a really nice spot for it. It is where I first make my coffee when I start the day. So I just think it is a perfect little corner to have my advent calendar and it is so cute. It really just suits the very natural aesthetic of my home. And I just thought this was such a great find. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this one and it gave you a little bit of inspiration for your advent calendars or just for a little bit of gifting and fun things to do around home. So I will be uploading, like I said, every single day for Vlogmas. So if you haven't already, definitely hit that subscribe button and tick on the little notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And I will see you guys in the next one where we can hang out for a little bit more of the festive season. Bye.